another Walmart Wednesday. I am thrilled to bring you more warm weather spring clothing. However, I'm not super springy in the first outfit. It's going to be difficult for me, you guys, today because it's snowing outside. But what can we do? That is the nature of living in Buffalo, New York. Anyway, you guys, I just want to let you know that this portion of today's video is sponsored by Dossier. You guys know I'm a Dossier ambassador. I think I've been for over a year now. I absolutely love them. They are an affordable fragrance company that has designer dupes. And today I am featuring a fragrance that I absolutely love, especially for springtime, especially if you're needing to lift your mood because it's snowing and all you want to do is go outside and not freeze to death. <laughs> This is called Fruity Orange, again by Dossier, and it is a dupe, you guys, for Clinique Happy. I know it's a classic. It's been around for years, but it really does make you happy. It has such a citrus smell, yet a little bit of floral in the back notes. I absolutely love it. By the way, if you use my discount code, you will save 10% off your purchase. Also, the wonderful thing about Dossier is that you get the fragrance get it home try it on wear it for a little bit decide whether or not you like it and it is guaranteed so if you don't like it you can return it and get your money back so it is a no risk a guarantee dossier knows it's difficult to pick out fragrances online so i think you guys are going to love whatever fragrance you get though so don't be worried about that again you're going to get 10 percent off and this is my all-time favorite. I will link everything for you in the description box below along with my discount code. I also always link my favorite men's fragrance because they have wonderful men's fragrances as well. So check that out in the description box below. You guys are gonna love it. And let me show you my favorite part, the magnetic cap. What could I say, right? All right, you guys, let me go over what I have on now. Some of it old, some of it new. I have to tell you, that I'm not a super huge fan of the jeans I'm wearing, but I feel it is my duty to show them to you. And I'll tell you why in a second. Let's go over my jewelry. All right, just plain gold hoops. These are my time and true. My large gold medallion necklace. You guys, this makes a statement. It's gorgeous. I love it. You've seen it a lot, but it's a fan favorite as well. Uh, wearing my stretchy gold bangle bracelets from Target and then my hammered uh, trio from Target comes with these and one other one, which I'm not wearing right now. All right, you guys. So this is the Scoop Blazer. It's the Scoop Scuba Blazer with scrunch sleeves. That's a lot of S's. Scoop, Scuba, and Scrunch. You'll not forget now, right? I'm wearing it in a size small. I love it. It's actually made of jersey. See how this is why they call it scrunched because it's kind of like scrunched. It's a three-quarter length sleeve but it's got a jersey knit material. It's so comfortable, you guys. It's almost like wearing a hoodie, like a sweatshirt type situation, but you have a blazer on, so you look very polished. Let me back up and show you. Also wearing one of my camis from this five pack of camis. I wear these in a size medium. They have different five packs, by the way. You can choose some neutrals like I have, or you can choose some that have uh, different colors in them. Again, I wear them in a size medium. This belt is actually from Target. I will link it for you. All right, so these are the jeans. And let me back up and you can see that they are kind of like in split colors here. I know, I wasn't 100% what they'd be like. They're not my favorite, but the reason why I feel it's my duty to show them to you anyways, because these are the Melissa High Rise Jeans by Sofia Vergara. And you guys know she has a ton of variations and I feel like it's, again, my duty to show you all of them. So last week I showed you guys the pull-on pair. I'll insert a picture. I would have to say recently, those are my all-time favorite. They are so comfortable and so flattering. You're gonna want them, you know, wear them every day. I almost said in every color, but I don't think they come in more than one color. Anyway, you guys, so these have this little detail on the side where you can have lighter on top. And then right here, she's been doing this. I'm gonna hold this for you. She's been doing that retro stitching on the side, which is really cute. I feel like when they're all one color, cause it's kind of like a little cool detail. I'm not a huge fan of this split color, but you guys maybe. So I'll make sure to link these below. I'm wearing them in a size four. And again, just put on my, uh, one of my camis in this blazer, but this blazer is gonna get you through everything because of the fact that it's Jersey. I have taken it out in the summertime, you know, it gets a little cooler at night and was able to fold it up and fit it into my purse, which by the way, let me grab a purse here. You guys know I've been loving this one. This is a really cute outfit. You guys get the blazer. It just elevates anything you're wearing. I mean, really, what am I wearing? A pair of jeans 
and just a cami. Yet, all of a sudden, I'm dressed up and I can actually wear all of this to dinner. Here's the back, and here's the back of these jeans. You know, this thing's popping. So if you ever got up, pocket placement is always on. Let me show you these sandals because, by the way, here's the purse. Love this, you guys. I'm not sure if it's still available. I should have checked. But it's gorgeous. It looks so high end. All right, quickly, let me show you my shoes. I'm talking too much again. We just got started here. But check these out. These are going to go with everything this summer, you guys. I did not self-tan this week, but when I was self-tanned a few weeks ago and had these on, they just elongate my legs so perfectly. I absolutely love that. So I think you guys are going to love them too. All right. I have lots to show you, so let me get moving. I'm going to switch up and I'm going to put some more springy, summery stuff on for you guys right now. All right, you guys, I am loving this outfit and I think you guys are going to love it too. Here's crazy already from trying these clothes on. Anyway, I just made a reel over on Instagram. So if you're not following me, go ahead and follow me over there. And I also post a TikTok now. Yes. And I will also put my link tree in the description box below so you can find all of my socials. I even have a Facebook, which I'm never over there. But if that's all you have, you can find me over there. All right, you guys, check out this look. I am featuring so much Sofia Vergara lately. It's unbelievable. I am wearing her paper bag faux leather shorts, you guys. They're so cute. I love them. They have pockets. They have this cute little tie. They're in a nice neutral color. I control myself. <laughs> but seriously, I absolutely love them. Now, if I had a little bit of a tan, they would look even cuter. Here's the back. They have two, um, these are faux pockets, but they're cute because they make the booty look good when you have something back there over having nothing back there. And I tucked in this really gorgeous knot shirt of hers. It's kind of like a twist, not really a knot, a twist front shirt. I'm wearing this in a small, and then the shorts are in a size four, if I didn't already say that. Also wearing my gold sideways initial necklace and my square gold hoops. What did I put on over here? Oh, I have my fave Well, my bracelet. I have to show you exactly how it is every time. It's just one, but it looks like three bangles. It's so easy to get on and off and so light. I just love that. And then my favorite ring from my stone trio of rings and everyone's favorite, the LV or Louis Vuitton dupe tote bag. You guys, this is like $21. Now don't be detoured when you look on the Walmart website, it might say that it takes a little bit to get like two weeks or something. It is so worth it. I love it. And you guys will too. All right, let me back up and show you. I'm not even gonna show you my shoes, you guys. Sorry, not sorry, but I'm wearing my clear strap studded sandals by Men NYC. You guys know I love these. I just, especially when I don't have any color on my legs, I just feel like they really give me a nice elongated look. What do you guys think about this outfit? It's all neutrals, all my faves, but it's so fun and so cute. I'm so excited. I cannot wait for warmer weather. I think I'm gonna, um, when I'm done filming, show you a little bit of what's going on outside and insert it somewhere in this video because it's the time of year where you've just had it. I do like the change of season. I absolutely love it around Christmas time. But, you know, that's about it. <laughs> All right, you guys. One last look at this cute outfit. Have to do it. Have to do it. By the way, you guys, this candle smells so good. I always link my, can my candle uh, du jour down in the description box below. That is a white peach and daisy, I believe. It smells fantastic. I also have one for the kitchen that I will link as well. It's like a lemon yeah, lemon basil or something. That also smells fantastic. I'm loving all of it. Guys, don't go anywhere else for candles. Walmart has all of the candles that you need and the scents are fantastic. All right, I'm gonna stop talking now and get to my next look. I have a purse that you guys are gonna freak over, I swear. Oh, and lip combo, it's coming up. And a new trick for doing your lips. I know, I'll be back. All right, guys, back with my next look. I think you guys are gonna love this. Before we get uh, into the outfit, let's take a look at the jewelry. There's something on my camera. It's making me look like there's something on my forehead. It's driving me crazy. Anyway, small gold medallion necklace, gold filigree earrings, and same um, ring and bracelet. Grabbed my cognac baguette. You guys know I love this one. It has the great pocket in the back and our fave, the hidden pocket in the front. I don't know why that's just so fun, but it is. So grab this. Now this dress, I'm wearing in a size small. I almost feel, and keep this in mind, if you're in between sizes, like I could size up just one based on right 
here and maybe like on the arm situation, but I don't know. I don't, I wouldn't want it to be too big on me either. It's gorgeous. It's a maxi dress by Sophia. Let me back up and show it to you. Pockets. Yes, it has pockets. I already discovered that on my own. So I didn't have, you know, a cardiac event while on camera here. But you guys, how easy and gorgeous is this? I love the black background with the beautiful, beautiful floral print. If you guys don't know this by now, floral print is on trend for spring 2023 and summer. So it's, you know, it's time to join in. I was never a huge floral print person, but this pattern, and I like those really neutral, soft floral patterns have been great for me. I'm loving them this season. So I think you guys will too. But this black background just shows off these gorgeous colors. Of course, I love the palm or tropical leaves in the background as well. It makes me hopeful that I will be seeing palm trees soon, and I will. So here is the back once again. I love the way it cascades all the way down to the floor. You guys know I am five feet, five inches tall. And this is where it hits for me. And to match my cute bag, at, and I really think that, you know, you could wear absolutely wear black or nude with this dress. I kind of just like the way this warm color, let me back up one, one sandal here, brings out all of the warm colors in the pattern. I don't know, I just thought that was really pretty. It gave more interest to the outfit. I actually have to admit, I initially put on a pair of black sandals and then I thought, mm, I really don't like that. So I went and changed into the cognac and I'm happy I did. Oh, sorry, I'm struggling to get that shoe on because you guys know I refuse to unbuckle that. Thank this dress is absolutely gorgeous. The pockets just make it that much better. I feel like, you know, when you walk in, you could just hang on to your little bag and just chill, just casually walk in with your hand in your pocket. <laughs> All right, you guys, this is a, an absolute favorite of mine so far in this haul. I have two more outfits to show you and then we'll get to the lip comb. I am back and I grabbed this purse. You guys are going to love it. It is actually from last year, but I'm bringing out all my Louis Vuitton dupes. I have another one I'll probably show you in a couple of weeks. This one is a crossbody, or you can wear it over your shoulder, which is how I like to wear it. It is gorgeous with this beautiful chain strap. It does, however, come with an additional strap that is more colorful and will help you make like a short crossbody, really cute with all the different colors. And then it has that same um, LV dupe material on the ends there so cute and let me show you how it looks after i go over everything i'm wearing so the jewelry as actually has not changed since last seen still the small gold medallion necklace the gold filigree earrings the bracelet and the trio of stone rings i'm wearing a blazer i am wearing a white tube top i'm going to link one for you this one is from target hopefully they have a, one again this year i could really use a new one this is an oversized blazer. I'm also gonna link one for you. I believe Free Assembly has one. I will insert a picture right here of the one I chose for you. But all that is really to feature these pants and shoes from Walmart, so check these out. You guys, I love this look. I think last week I told you about a store called Aritzia where they wear oversized blazers, little tiny shirts underneath, and trouser pants. That was kind of the look I was going for with this. These trouser pants, let me take everything off for you. Love, love, love the way this all looks. I'm super into blazers, you guys. I have not been wearing them because I have to wear a big puffy coat. And I'm like, how am I gonna put that over a blazer and just the whole thing? I don't feel like pull, pulling out the heavy long wool coat either. I know, I'm being a big baby about the weather. This is what I do every year at this time of year. I can't help myself. All right, these are my scoop. I'm wearing them in a size four. They have a nice flat front to them. They're not super wide leg. They're more of like a, kind of like a very conservative flare. They're not flaring super wide. They're so comfortable. I have plenty of room, you guys. Look, in a size four. I love them. I love the length. They're not too long. They're not too short. If I had to guess, I would say they're maybe third, between a 31 and a 32 inch inseam. They're high-waisted. So that means you could wear your little crop shirts and do that whole Aritzia look that I keep talking about and without having your belly hanging out because, you know, I, I don't know about you, but I don't want to do that at 51 years old. Here is the back. They have um, slits for pockets. Let me see, excuse me while I check for, okay, they're full pockets. I know, but I had to. 
um, which I actually like better because I hate fiddling with the lining. I actually have a really nice pair of trousers from Express that have the lining. They're, you know, real functional back pockets. Every time I walk, the lining gets bunched up. I'm constantly putting my hands in to try and smooth them out and they just don't stay that way. So I do prefer these faux pockets in the back. And I don't know, I just love this look, you guys. This is it for me. I love, love, love this look. This, these pants would be great for any event that you have, going out to dinner, you, you can cash it up. You can also wear a normal shirt and wear these to work, which I will be doing. And I have to debut these shoes this week. Yes, you guys, Sam and Libby, check these out. OMG, are these adorable or what? Okay, this is not braided. It's sort of like a weave, like a basket weave. Look at again, the nail heads, the details, you guys, the rubber bottoms, the gorgeous faux wooden um, footbed, and they're so comfy. They remind me of, oh, and you guys, this is actually um, soft. So this part's not wooden. See that little strip right there? They made that super soft for us. Thank you, Sam, and thank you, Libby. I think they got divorced. I don't know. There's a whole story behind the Sam and Libby company. <laughs> We're not getting into that right now. But I absolutely love them, you guys. So different purse this week or this round. And finally, some cool shoes, different ones. Actually, you guys know I've been loving all the shoes this season. I just love warm weather clothing. What can I say? All right, you guys, last outfit. And then we're going to get to this lip combo. Back with my next look. Guess who it's by? You'll never guess. Sofia Vergara. Listen, I went on the website and I was like, I want this, I want this, I want to try that. I got to show them this. So here we are. All right, you guys, this is a fave because, you know, it's black. I put my large gold medallion necklace back on, kept the earrings, and, oh, bracelets the same, but I did put my um, double stacked scoop gold rings on. I've been double stacking them. You can wear them on different fingers. They're gorgeous, you guys. Grab these. They're so beautiful. They stack just gorgeous. Anyway, grab the bag out again. And I put on the Cognac Shoes by Steve Madden. Did we show these last time? Why am I like, it's like hours between takes, I feel like. But these guys, put these guys back on because again, I wanna summarize this dark black dress, even though it really is. It's got this gorgeous eyelet material, you guys. And this sleeve is nice and loose. So I'm not understanding. This is why you guys gotta watch me because I can tell you, I can get this shoe on, I swear. Oh yeah, I did show these because wasn't I doing this last scene? Hold on, let me get this shoe on. <laughs> Look who's out back with their shoes on. Anyway, um, this one fits perfectly fine and it's nice and easy. So watch me, that way I could test out all the stuff for you guys and you won't have to have trouble ordering when it comes to sizing. Also, I wanted to tell you that those trousers that I just showed you, I said they were in a size four. They're actually a small. So they run small, medium, large. The small is a four, six. If you're in between sizes, I would size down to be honest because there's plenty of room in there. So I, I felt like they were, they fit very well. All right, let me stop talking and show you the dress. So I'm not gonna show you this. You guys know that whole look and what it looks like. Let me back up. Okay, this entire dress is eyelet and it has then its own lining underneath. Is it separate? Yeah. It has this stretchy lining underneath. It stops right here. And it's got a tear at the bottom. It's kind of like fitted in through the waist up here. Nice and stretchy. Look at, here's the back. Let me show you this. Um, so this is stretchy. This is stretchy. So comfy, you guys. I absolutely love it. I keep on thinking there's going to be pockets here, but this one does not have pockets. Put your hands down. Okay, fine. Um, and it's almost like a midi. It's not quite white and maxi again I'm five feet five inches tall and this is where it kind of lands but you know how some middies hits you, hit you in the absolute worst part of your legs I don't know about you guys but that happens to me this one is absolutely perfect I also discovered excuse me for a second there that you kind of pull this off your shoulders just be careful and it kind of looks cute as well that changes the entire look love that so once again, Sophia seems to be my girl for the summer. I don't know why. I think because she has so many dresses and I absolutely love them all. So maybe that's the reason why, I'm not really sure. All right, let me move the camera around a bit here so I can focus on these lipos. So the one trick I wanted to show you guys today was 
that I've been putting bronzer. You can see it, watch. See that little spot of bronzer? That is creating a little bit of a shadow under the center only of my bottom lip. And I feel like it just makes them look more natural when I overline in that section, it kind of all blends. And I've also been doing it a bit at the top, you can't really tell. Um, and I also feel like that makes everything look more natural. And I don't mean because I have lip filler, I mean because I overline. And sometimes you could say, oh, hi, you overlined your lips. But with that bronzer, it kind of blends it a little bit better into your natural lip. It's hard to describe. I think next week, maybe I will show it to you on camera. Not going to do it now, but I will definitely do that for you guys next week. Okay, coming in with NYX in the color Sand Beige, you guys. And this is very pigmented, which I love. Here's the color, just your classic nude, right? But watch. You could just see it so well. So... I lined top and bottom a little overlining, let it drop off on the sides. Then I came in because I wanted sort of a matte with the uh, Maybelline Ultimate in the color More Blonde. I haven't shown you guys this in a while. There's the color, very classic nude, pinky nude, I want to say. And I filled in my entire lips. But then I was like, well, I need some gloss now that I've just used a matte. I know, crazy, right? But more Maybelline Lifter Gloss in the color Crystal. I love this one, you guys. It's got like a bronzy color to it. See there on the tip? But it just goes on so beautifully, watch. Beautiful, love, love, love it. So this is the lip combo of today. All right, you guys, I've kept you here long enough trying to find pockets and everything. <laughs> if you did like today's video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel and helps other people to find me. And if you've not already, please subscribe to my channel and hit that bell for notifications. That way you'll be notified each and every time I upload a video. I will see you guys here three times a week now. I don't know if you saw my Timu Tuesday video from yesterday, but if you haven't, go check it out. So we will now be doing Mondays, all different things on Mondays, Timo on Tuesdays, and our fave Walmart on Wednesdays. I hope you all have a great week, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye, everyone.